And you notice, right, perhaps not surprisingly based on its formula, it looks a lot like water, right? It's H2O2, it's not that much different than water, it has a little different boiling point, melting point, stuff like that. But like I was saying, it's not very stable. But do you see anything happening right now? Does it look like I'm forming a bunch of oxygen or anything like that? It's just kind of water, right? Just in theory, water. So what I'm going to do, this is purely for um, flashy purposes. But I'm going to go ahead and add a little food coloring. Let's go with green. It seems like we have a lot of green going on here. Just so we can kind of see what's going on in here a little bit better. So it's just a little green. Did adding green do anything other than change the color? So it just kind of looks like peroxide, right? And again, when I make this reaction start, I'm going to form a bunch of oxygen, right? And so in order to capture some of these oxygen uh, molecules, I'm going to add a little bit of soap just so we can form some bubbles again. So here we've got a little soap action. I'm going to kind of stir this in here. But again, I mean, does it look like much is going on? Maybe a little soap bubbles. Not, not kind of a lot. I like that green, though. It's pretty. <laughs> mm -hmm. I need to wash your hair with that next one. Yeah, I wash my hair with it. <laughs> <Good> color. <laughs> yeah. Like <laughs> I'm sure that looked great. Um, so, some of you who have had chemistry before, or maybe you've heard these reactions, you've probably heard this word before. Um, this reaction's not going right now, but I can add something to it and, and make it go much catalyst. more quickly. A catalyst, right? A catalyst. And we'll talk a lot more about catalysts. And what I have here is, what is this stuff? Potassium iodide. Potassium iodide, right? Potassium iodide. Ki. We know Ki. Um, so what's going to happen is that potassium iodide can catalyze this reaction. And it doesn't really matter how much of this I put in here, it's going to catalyze this breakdown. And so what we want to see is, if you know, do we see any observable change here? Do we see a chemical reaction form? Do we see our, our uh, oxygen form and, and whatnot? So I'm going to go ahead and add this stuff. You guys can all see. Yeah, let's do this. Add this real quick. Um, that's enough. <laughs> so, Holy. So, that's like one of those so I, all of these bubbles, most of these bubbles are filled with oxygen, right? Just pure, pure oxygen. And again, I added the soap just so we could kind of see the volume of air that is coming out of this stuff. And the greens just added a nice little, little green, little food coloring. But right, all of this stuff, everything that you just saw uh, was going to happen anyways just over a much longer period of time. Hmm. And by adding this catalyst, all I did was I made it happen all, like, right now. And you can see... Kind of intense. Kind of intense, right? There's a lot of... And it, you kind of smell... I don't know if you can sketch yeah, it. Yeah, it's like it's so baby white. Like, smell, yeah. It's got, it's got kind of a soapy smell, and also like has a kind powder. of... Uh, mm -hmm. I don't know, cleaning sort of powder, or a uh, uh, smell. But yeah, you can see well, it's still slowly... <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I mean the peroxide, that sort of disinfecting yeah, sort of yeah, sort of smell. <laughs> but it slowed down a lot, right? We just have a slow, uh, slow amount of bubbles coming out. If I, by the way, when I did this for like third graders, they go so before I lit a match right with the CO2 stuff and what happened it kind of blew it out even when I got close to this stuff right but what's in these bubbles and so what do you think will happen with oxygen it's gonna yeah it's gonna help this burn faster a lot of people think that oxygen we'll talk about this a little more a lot of people think oxygen is flammable yeah. Like those yeah. tanks say flammable. No. It's not flammable. You can't light Fires. oxygen on fire. <laughs> oxygen helps you light things on fire, right? You need oxygen in order for things to, to burn. What's up with the, like, they tell us never to put, like, oils or anything around oxygen tanks that have Yeah. Oh, because those can burn real, real nice with oxygen, extra <laughs> oxygen around. Yeah. Makes it feel good with it. So, if you look at this, you'll notice that the, it doesn't put it out. Well, that's cool. It just kind of starts to burn a little bit more. Right, so it's just helping the the match burn a little bit faster. So when you burn up the foam, what is the the chemical coming off of it? Like, what is the gas? What is this gas, or what is coming off what of? What is coming off? Of the flame? So we're gonna talk about combustion. It's just it's actually just carbon dioxide and water. Okay. Just carbon dioxide and water because this is wood. It's mostly made up of normal carbohydrate yeah. things, which are just carbon, hydrogen, and oxygen. So it's making more carbon dioxide and water. That's okay. the idea. 
And every now and again, it looks kind of cool <coughs> if I can get it to work. Can Sorry, all the matches. Is if you drop this sucker in, sometimes it's cool. So let's see what. Ooh. <laughs> 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 so, it's so it just kind of burned a nice hole through here and completely burned the match. There's just a big hole going through the foam now. So yeah, so oxygen just helps things burn. It does not burn, right? And you didn't, this whole thing didn't go, right? It just helped my match, which can burn. It just helped it burn faster was all. Okay, but here's a good example of a chemical reaction, right? I rearranged the atoms, right? It still have the same number of atoms. I just rearranged how they were connected. So I took some of those hydrogen peroxide, strong oxidizer, whoops, strong oxidizer will bleach your hands, bleach your hair, uh, cleans wounds, whatnot, turn it into basically just water. Water and a whole bunch of oxygen is all, is all we did. Um, so let me clean this up now. <laughs>